One of the areas hard hit by power outages and fallen trees is the area along both American River and Fair Oaks Boulevard. KCR 3's Mike Tassell is live along American River Drive with an up close look at some of that damage, Mike. And actually, we moved over off of Eastern Avenue. We're at Eastern and Las Cruces, and this is a spot catching a lot of attention because of that right there, another tree down. You can see how the entire root ball of that tree literally came up, and the tree crashing on the home. What is interesting here is this happened early, early this morning, around 4 a.m., and crashed right into a bedroom where a 10 year old child was sleeping on the top of a bunk bed. Let me take you inside. Take a look and you'll see just how close uh, you know one of the limbs speared through the roof uh, nearly coming within inches of that 10 year old child who was sleeping said uh, I actually talked to that boy on uh, Logan he told me he had a blue pillow and it was uh, pretty close to where he was sleeping fortunately everybody was okay in fact I did have a chance to talk to the uh, resident here who said uh, yeah this is not something he expected and of course he had to make a phone call listen Called my work. I said, uh, I had a tree come down on the house, so I'm not going to be in. It's, uh, so now we just got to deal with this. You know, fortunately, no cars done, anything like that. And how, how thankful are you that the tree didn't actually hit anything? Oh, I'm just, I'm just happy everybody's hurt, not hurt. I mean, it's, it's damaged. It can be fixed. You know, that's not a big deal. And back out here live, this is actually kind of indicative of uh, what you see throughout this entire area. By the way, that's Logan. That's the 10 year old child who was uh, sleeping there. He's OK, uh, untouched by this tree that crashed into the home. But really, uh, this scene is something we've seen play out uh, throughout this area in the Arden area. Just around the corner, there's another tree into a home. And then uh, along Fair Oaks Boulevard all morning, we've seen trees that have had to be cleared off of Fair Oaks Boulevard. And if you were on American River Drive, uh, another tree near the apartment complex complex uh, closest to Watt Avenue, uh, also catching a lot of attention and also creating a lot of power outages in this area. In fact, uh, a lot of the uh, intersections, the traffic signals remain defective or not working at all. So again, as a reminder, treat those as a four way stop. As for these trees, cleanup clearly going to take quite some time as a lot of these uh, trees in the homes in a lot of these areas. There's no crews around to start uh, the work of cutting them down, although contractors have been stopping by offering their assistance once they are able to get to spots like this. Live off of Eastern Avenue at Las Cruces, Mike Tassel, KCRA 3D. Yeah, total mess there. All right, Mike, thank you.